about to do now is what I call run the rack. And we're going to be doing this on leg presses. And running the rack simply means going from your lighter weights to your heavier weights and pyramiding up to that weight. Now, the kicker to this, this is going to be 10 sets of 10 to 12 on the leg press machine. Note the way that I go up and wait, and I also wait for the kicker at the end. And that's what you call running the rack. And if you're not willing to work, this is something that I would not suggest. We starting off with uh, one plate, we have two plates. Two plates, a plate on each side. Second set, two more plates. Set. Two more plates. <laughs> minimum minimum rest. Minimum rest. Two more plates. <laughs> Thank you. 
Two more plates. Right now we're at uh, 10 plates. And that's a normal workout for when I'm working out, doing leg presses and doing legs. And this right here is the building up part. I get up to these 10 plates, and the kicker is what I do next. Down to six plates. Ah. Down the four plates. Real life workout as I do it on leg pressing 
And pretty much all my exercises, this is what I do. And that's going to be it for my leg workout for the day. And I've worked out this way for a number of years. And it always have been effective in allowing me to uh, increase the weights over time. I have a certain amount of weights uh, that I like to lift on a regular basis so that my body will be accustomed to that particular weight. And uh, when I decide that I want to uh, test my strength, I have a good basis in which to start back uh, adding weight on again. But this is the way that I do it. I run the rack and this also helps you to load the machine up or bar or whatever it is that you're doing and unload the bar at the same time. And you not, you not only not have the issue of someone telling you to clean up behind yourself, you've also... Um, You've also, you, you've also had a uh, phenomenal uh, workout for that particular body part or whatever it is that you're working. And that right there is a quick way of doing 10 sets uh, using a uh, basic machine movement. And if you want to build uh, big legs, that's the way to do it. That's the way to do it. You want to keep that blood volume high. You know, it's obvious that I can lift way more weight than I'm lifting here but the purpose is not the weight the purpose is to exercise the muscle and that's how you do it and before I did these leg presses I also did uh, five sets of leg curls the exact same way I pyramided up uh, with the leg curls and I also did uh, seated calf raises before I did these leg presses so I'm always advocating Working the calves out, working the calves out, working the calves out with any type of leg exercises. Do not forget the calves. That that right there is what make the lower body uh, complete. And that's the best way to do it. Anyway, that's what I want to talk to you all about. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe to the channel. And again, I'll be talking to you later.